Society is rightly asking the question of whether we can grow mining at the pace and scale required to meet the demands of the energy transition while protecting and preserving nature. Our position statement provides a comprehensive pathway for how our sector can contribute to nature positive outcomes. Big challenges present even bigger opportunities and businesses like ours have an important role to play. Our ambition drives us to find better ways to operate in a way that doesn't result in loss of biodiversity. It's about being an active part of the solution, doing our part to protect and restore biodiversity for generations to come. It means a measurable commitment to protecting and restoring nature, which is essential to the health of our planet, to human well-being, as well as to the economy. Through development of our Nature Position Statement, we've engaged with a huge range of different stakeholders to understand their views on our impact on nature, but also what our contribution towards nature recovery could look like. We agreed on the need for urgent actions to halt nature laws and protect and restore the natural ecosystems we all depend on. There's also a component around data. So we collect so much data through our environmental monitoring. If we could harness that and share that with conservation programs, the mining industry can make a significant contribution towards conservation and restoration of nature. ICMM's nature position statement raises the standard for nature performance in our industry by laying out an important roadmap to the future. And that work applies not just to the land, but all of nature, including fresh water, oceans, and our planet's atmosphere. I hope that this will not only be a blueprint for the mining industry, but could be a blueprint for other sectors that have an impact on nature too. None of us individually can solve this problem, but if each of us plays the part that we must play, we will be able to halt and reverse nature loss by 2030.